like a lot of antidotes like a lot <laughs> i'm gonna be stacked on and antidotes like i'm gonna overdose on antidotes antidote antidote antidotes that's not where i want to go though i need to drop from somewhere I need to drop the base It's not here either. I don't know where it is then, man. It's the heads up. Uh, this is actually a boss room. I remember fighting this boss as well. Man, it's been so long. <laughs> yeah, I remember it. Um, I'm actually gonna park here and actually just see where the uh, where that uh, where the clothes are. Poison, resist, clothes, bloodborne. All right. Before I actually continue this, uh, I'm gonna go and and uh, and take a break again. I'll be back really quick. If I take a break, I mean pee. Okay, uh, all right, let's go, let's go Bloodborne, let's go, Cathedral Ward in Bloodborne, it offers poison resistance, it's great to use against Blood Starved Beast, yep, that's the one that I'm using. God, just tell me the location. Okay, so it's near the ambushes area from what I gather. So that's where I'm going to head towards. My God. Thank you for the internet. It's great. Internet is pretty amazing. I also want to see like if there's any ladders here that I can climb. Because there is a drop. There's a ladder here. But I, I already climbed this. But I wasn't able. I wasn't successful at finding what I was looking for. And this is the gate that I opened. So this is the wrong way. I have to go this way instead. And when I go this way. This is the other way. Dude, where the hell am I? Is it this way? No. Did I come inside this gate? I did. Okay. Did I go up to top there? I did not. I went over here and I went inside this place. But before and I progressed here killed all these people opened this shortcut
I don't even remember like where did I go? I guess I can just get these. I actually don't want to engage in combat with them because I don't really need the blood echoes. There's that thing. Well, what are you? for me. Oh my god, he's following me. Oh! Run. It would be funny if I already have those. I don't. Okay, good. Uh, where are the clothes? Just thinking. I think the way that I went before is actually like up top there. I, I, th I think that the clothes are most likely there. Because this guy sucks. Like it's really bad. That's the only guy that I have actually. Okay, I guess I'm just going to go to the place where I haven't gone before and hopefully that it's it's there. The place that I just jumped from, that that's the place that I wanted to actually go and just explore. But the thing is like due to uh, the stuff that just happened there, I I didn't have a choice to get out of there as soon as possible. But somehow I bet that regardless of whether I have that or not, I'm still not going to be able to do it. Like, I think that the poison resist that it will offer me is still not enough to, uh, to, like, not use the antidotes. So that's where that thing was.
something happening in here. Oh, okay. That that's actually the door that was Yeah, okay. Okay. Got some antidotes, which is good. Is this the shortcut? I can't go there yet. All right. Oh. So it should be around these parts that I'm currently traversing in. It's not like all the way up where I was before. So. Maybe it's like on one of these. Corpses. Praise you, praise the old damn church, and then it's the best of our country, best fucker of all. <laughs> 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 praise you, praise the old damn church, and then it's the best of our country, best fucker. Uh, well, that was something, huh? Uh, yep. Way more resist. Way more resist. Look at the difference. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if it works as good as it looks, I will be pleasantly surprised. Make sure I have everything good. Black church, black church, surgical loves the highest. Yep. And yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, so pretty much that's what I'm gonna be doing. And uh, we are going to either progress. We're not gonna progress. Why are we not gonna progress? The reason why. There is no reason actually. Oh yeah, antidotes. That's what I need to do. So that's why I'm not going to progress. However, I did open up a couple of shortcuts, so I never have to come back here again. I'm not too worried about this, regardless of what happens. I just have to figure out a way to get back. And if I remember right, there is a way to get back. Because I opened up a shortcut, so that's where I'm going to head towards now. 
god though like i can't uh if this thing really like i will be yeah it will make things it'll make life a lot more easier if this actually functions the way it's supposed to did i remember uh in dark souls one i used this mage set and pretty much i used it for the entirety of the time even though i was melee i still used it for the entirety of the game primarily because of the fact that that set pretty much made my resistances so good that it made things much much more bearable if i remember right i just have to take a right here then take a l right here and then just go down there'll be, there'll be like one or two more guys that i have to fight so probably just one and a crow i guess no And there we have it. All right. Oh, uh, I'm actually gonna head back first, and uh, yeah, and I'm gonna buy antidotes. I'm gonna do all that crazy good stuff. She's still dead, huh? Yeah. Before I do anything, I'm going to upgrade my weapon. Which I can't do. Maybe blood gem fortification. Okay. That's uh, really good. That's also really good. Okay, great. Physical attack up. Physical attack patch at full HP. Which will not really matter much because i'm not going to be full hp most likely because there's poison but regardless it's better than nothing uh in addition to that let me see if there's something i unlocked here nope okay antidote 16. yeah that's fine no worries. Only six bullets, huh? Wait, is it the entire thing? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not. Alright. I can have 10 antidotes at a time. I got these set. Everything should work according to plan. Dodge left is the key. As long as I can keep on doing that, I'll be fine. I just need to pay attention.
with the proper equipment and a bit more uh, attack, I pretty much was able to kill it. So, yeah, it was all worth it, definitely. Oh god, that was rough though. Um, it's good that I went through all of that, and I didn't even like have to like level up. That was fantastic, really good. I already know where the next boss is because I just did it. So it's pretty, it's pretty awesome. And the next boss is going to be pretty much just a lot of slashes and stuff. I remember. I believe that's how far I got. And I don't think I ever beat her. Uh, I just ended up just constantly just being um, just just constantly dying over and over and over again it was really bad so let's see just want to see if something's better blood defense arcane is low poison stuff oh, everything else is actually good and physical defense is actually good so I think I'm gonna wear the hat again Currently, the c the this one is looking to be the best one right now, yeah, the black church one. So I think I'm gonna I'm gonna rock that for that. Sixty, fifty, sixty, sixty, sixty. Yeah, go with that. Sixty, sixty. Okay, things are much better now. I'm kind of happy that I, I finally beat it, man. That boss. God. I don't think I got something new, so no point in doing this. The healing church and the blood ministers who belong to it were well, once guardians of the hunters in the times of the hunter Ludwig they worked and forged weapons in their unique workshop today most ministers don't recall the hunters but they have much to offer you and so Heed the message of your forebears. Ascend to Erden Chapel. Ascend from there. You will find the church workshop. Okay. At this point, uh, I want to get another weapon, however, I don't have it yet. And that's the weapon that I'm going to be using for the majority of the game. However, uh, I don't have it yet. Kirk Hammer is pretty good, but I don't really want the Kirk Hammer right now. Uh, so, yeah, I guess I'm going to have to discover it at some point or something. Welcome home. What is it? Very well, let me. I can, I can only do one level. I think increasing my damage is more vital right now. I'm going to do 16 strength instead. find your worth in the waking world welcome home what is it over time countless hunters have visited this dream the graves here stand in their memory it all seems so long ago now over time the it all farewell good may you
I I just want to go and check to see if I missed something. If I didn't, then I will uh, go towards the new area and explore it and uh, and have some fun in there. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Um, whenever I get a bit nervous, especially like if I'm like stuck on something, I usually I usually just uh, like constantly <laughs> just talk and. Uh, and I feel that as like a as like a person that creates videos and video content and things like that, uh, that's not necessarily good. Um, yeah, so I do apologize for that. It's just uh, you know, it's it, it's a way for me to cope uh, what I'm feeling. I guess if that makes any sense. I don't know. Turn to hundred dream. Welcome home. What is it? Farewell. Oh, sorry about that. Um, I'm really considering just not having the web camera on, primarily because it's not really needed, you know. Um, and I guess what I mean by that is that I I have it on, but I feel that it doesn't necessarily enhance um the video in any way what it does is that it just clutters it up with just me sitting here uh and you can see me talking and see my expressions but in majority of the cases i think that i am able to show those or i guess make you uh see those expressions um by just me just talking like uh i, I usually express them in a pretty good way i think but then again, that that's just me saying about myself, right? So I could be, so I I could be definitely yeah. wrong. So, but uh, rec okay, this this door is open. Why, why is this open? Whatever. Let's go up and find out. But uh, I think that uh, streaming with a webcam is not necessarily like a good thing. Uh, actually this is a brand new area I don't want to go here yet because this is actually s this is uh, an area which I don't remember anything about but I know that I need to kill another boss uh, so that's what I'm going to be wor working towards but before I even do that I need to refer to the uh, guide uh, and before I even do that I'm going to actually just uh, oh, turn off my webcam alive and well are ya this here is a safe place stay back if you find any squizzins I might uh, like resume it at some point in the future or something but right now like like cause like how I have it is that I have like a monitor which is like just uh, it has just white here I'll just show it to you that's my bike <laughs> so as you could see this monitor is actually what is what is bringing the light uh, and that's why my face is like lit like this and I think that it is it's not necessarily distracting but it doesn't really help in any way either so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna just turn the monitor off and turn the web webcam off because without it as you can see it's very dark <laughs> because all, all of the lights are off so uh and with it on it it makes a big difference but i'm done for now so thank you peace in terms of webcam obviously <laughs> all right It also makes it so that I can actually 
fits it a bit more comfortably and I can, you know, start to do stuff like pick my notes and stuff <laughs> without uh, without uh, worrying about anybody judging me and stuff like that. Even though, like, judging me should be... I shouldn't worry about it, but I do, so... It's something that we humans do. Right, one more time, come on. Was blue elixir. Oh, well, that's cool. Now I can summon this person right now, but I'm not sure what would be the point of this. Oh yeah, speaking of which, I actually need to refer to the guide one sec. So I've obtained the monocule. Monocule. I've returned to the lonely old woman who is now in the cathedral. I returned to Gilbert and got the flame sprayer. I got I returned to the girl with the uh, with you know that wanted to give the toy toy box to her mother. Um, I purchased the hunter chief em emblem and I will uh, managed to open the gate which allowed me to you know make a shortcut I guess. Uh what else? Uh, and I enabled it so that I can actually enter the the old hunters DLC however I don't have it so we're not gonna do it right now um, additionally what I did was I entered the cathedral ward oh okay well one sec we have company Okay, uh, so additionally, uh, what we did was we entered the Cathedral Ward, uh, uh, evaded Dajura's Gatling gun, and continued through the boss. Killing Dajura now will give you the powder. Ah, uh, I see, okay. So the old Yarnhum, which is like the dude that was constantly shooting, you know, bullets at us and stuff like that, we're not gonna do that right now. Uh, we're not gonna go there because apparently. Apparently, we, we can actually just kill him. Um, Who is the Jura? One sec, sorry. Just l l let me just confirm this really quick. The Jura is a non-player character found... Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, this is the guy, okay. So that's the guy that was sh shooting stuff, and apparently you can befriend him. Okay, alright. 
So we're done with old yarns. So uh, I'm I'm actually just reading stuff right now, uh, which will give me more insight on what I should do. Get it? Insight. Yeah, anyways, one second. So heal healing church workshop. Uh, the previously closed door near the cathedral lab will now open. Obtain the radiant sword on top of the old, oh, abandoned old workshop. So that's something that I haven't done yet. Uh, defeating the will open the way to the church healing church workshop. Thereby getting to Vicar Emilia. Who is Vicar Emilia? I see. Okay. So that's that's actually the next boss. Uh, without buying the however doing so will not un unable so you can actually summon people for that boss fight i i won't do it i will actually just try to just beat it by myself which it will be quite difficult because i don't remember much about it um all right uh previously closed door near the church will now open obtain the radiant sword pre previously near the cathedral okay okay so so pretty much uh, what i need to do now is i need to go down there because there is another area that just opened up uh, and it's not the one that i went towards it's actually something entirely different so we're gonna see if we can find it not down there is it no it has to be here the previously closed door near the cathedral lamp will now be open obtain the radiant at the top of the old abandoned workshop at the top of the old abandoned workshop okay so i went up top there is the guy back is he here no okay oh yeah i i killed him did the save so and i got something what did i get any music box i got something i, I don't know what that was oh well whatever doesn't matter obtain the radiant sword hunter badge that's let me see what it looks like So, according to this, it should be around here, but I believe it was called like commission or something, right? Maybe I already have it in the workshop or something. Speaking of which, um, yeah, because if I go down there, like that's actually like an entirely new area. So I don't really want to do that right now. Okay, so we're gonna skip that. Uh, obtain the one third umbilical cord. Abandoned old workshop. Let me just see where this is. Okay, go around, dro drop down, and enter the doorway ahead. Okay, so so this is what it wants me to do, is to actually go over here. Okay, so basically uh, the objective is now to... To go straight in, but don't enter this building. Go around the right side, drop down, and enter the doorway ahead. Okay, so we have to run this, but don't enter this. Take a right. And does it drop down? Into the doorway uh, further ahead. Okay. Let's drop down. <laughs> okay. That's fine. Okay. Uh, after that, there are several drops here. The goal is to not reach the bottom. Drop on the left side before the walkway kind of want to go back but I shouldn't okay so pretty much 
I just have to not die here. So let me just verify. The goal is to not reach the bottom. Drop on the left side before the walkway and land on a small platform. Drop on the left side. So this, right? Before the walkway, wow. Drop again to the next wall platform. I see, that sucks. Apparently, looking for somewhere where there's a door. That's a that's a window. Okay, I think it's over here. No, nope, that's not it. Not this way, no. Did I miss it? I don't know where it is. Drop again to the next platform and open the door. <laughs> There's no door here, man. I messed up. I can't go there. Where is the door? I assume I have to drop down here, right? Stop messenger hat. Oh, that's where it is. That's th that's the door right there. But I'm on the other side. I've screwed up, man. I screwed up. I mean, the only way I can actually get back now is by using the charm thing. Unless I want to get that last one there. Which could be pretty difficult. I think I can do it, though. Yeah, I did. Okay. okay, so I messed up. Uh, I'm gonna retry. So we're going to be doing the same thing, except this time I'm not going to mess up.
Wasn't that fun? <sighs> How unfortunate. I need to read a bit more to get to that point. I could also just look at a YouTube video, but I'd rather just read it, you know? Okay, so let's uh, review what was the thing. Okay, so goal is not reach the bottom. Drop on the left side before the walkway to land on a small platform. Okay, so let me just take a look here on where am I supposed to land. And also let me use the lamp. I should actually equip it on one of my items. There. Uh. So the problem I have with this is that it wants me to fall somewhere, okay? He said the left side facing what? Facing this? If 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 I'm facing this to the left side, what is down there? That. Okay. If I'm facing right and if I'm facing this way and it's on the left side, what am what am I facing right there? Can I actually use bino binoculars maybe? That's not what I wanted to do. That's not helping at all. <laughs> right. The only platform that I see is this one right here. I don't actually see... Okay, I do see another one. Right, left. I've decided to just watch the video. So, give me one sec, because I don't know exactly what they're talking about. This guy has some cool armor too. He's like the uh, he's like the old Flash from s from season two. Yeah.
That's a <laughs> that's a jump. Okay. Uh, I wonder if the other one is easier because this one that they're showing me is insane, like really insane. Let me just see if I can do it. Pretty much the jump that they're asking for. So like this is the side, right? And this is the left side. And what they want me to do is they want me to like jump on one of these platforms. But I wonder if there's like another way in which like it doesn't require me to just try multiple times. watching also like these guys have like their brightness up all the way which is uh, I don't think the optimal way to play Also, the amount of HP that they lose is so significant, it's just insane. Alright then. This is it. Oh, sorry. I actually messed up. Because there's one specific thing. You have to actually line it up. Which which boards? Okay. Okay. It's actually not these ones, but the other ones. Does he jump? No, he just runs. Okay. That's it. Okay. Wow. What a... Uh, wow. That's insane. I would have never known. If this guy didn't tell me. And this is actually optional too. You don't really need to do that. But I figure why not. That's interesting.
Here I'm just exploring to see if I didn't miss anything. Let me actually see. So obtain the black spirit shed. Uh, shed. <laughs> okay, so pretty much. Uh, let me see. Obtain the radiant sword hunter badge at top. Radiant Sword Hunter Badge. Yeah, I don't... 